forest being an oasis of calm, this one's absolutely deafening. And it's incredible watching the speed and the scale of this destruction, but it's sustainable. This forest is being cleared this year. In a couple of years' time, it'll be replanted. Felling a hundred trees an hour, the high-tech harvester cuts the precise lengths ordered by the sawmill. Today, it's for door frames and decking, much of it heading our way. Back on the coast, the log pile grows to feed the automated production line. Only a few people are needed to transform a forest into cut timber. Well, that's extraordinary. We're looking out at an ocean of logs. Yeah, you know, this is a pretty large mill. So we will process around a thousand logs per hour. So all the logs you will see here will be consumed in one and a half week. Half of the output of this mill is for export to the UK. So within the space of just a couple of weeks, a tree that was once standing in a Swedish forest can be brought here, converted into sawn timber and loaded onto a ship bound for Britain to end up perhaps in a builder's merchant somewhere.